We're busy with developing news from the city of Cranston. At this hour, police are searching for an armed robbery suspect who held up this business on Reservoir Avenue. Brazen gunman actually held a gun to one worker's head. Now we have learned the man responsible for tonight's armed robbery could also be responsible for robberies in Providence, Johnston, and Pawtucket. Eyewitness News reporter Catherine Sotnik joins us just back from the scene. She's live in our studio with more. Well, police say the suspect has a very unique description tonight, a very large beard. He is on Rhode Island's Most Wanted, and tonight he may have struck again. Put it in the head of the man. Kathleen Donis describes how she saw that robber hold a gun to the head of an Aaron store worker on Reservoir Ave in Cranston. The 14-year-old in the store with her parents Wednesday night when that suspect came in and threatened everyone. I was on a laptop, and I see this man walk in. He looks suspicious. And my mom pulls me, and I'm like, oh, what, what's wrong? And I look at him, and he has, he has a gun on the man's head. Police say the suspect may be this man on Rhode Island's Most Wanted, who robbed a used car lot in Johnston last week, and the same man who robbed the Citizens Bank in Pawtucket in December. An Aaron Stork clerk who didn't want to be identified describes the suspect as having an Abraham Lincoln-like beard. He came in. Uh... Uh, with, a, with a funny looking beard, uh, put the, pulled out the gun and told everybody to drop. Those in the store say they were in shock. He took the gun out and um, he said don't move to the man. And to the clerk? Yeah, to him. And, um, and he put that gun up to his head? Yeah. Entró y se puso a hablar con el señor. Decirle. Okay, that she was, um, she seen when the man walked in and she was talking to the man. So when she see that he pulled out the gun, she grabbed me and told me to go. And Providence police are also investigating an armed robbery that happened around 6 o'clock tonight at the Savers Mart on Elmwood Avenue. The suspect there also with a similar description, including a beard. I'm Catherine Slotnick, Eyewitness News.